guys i am going to show you the types of cascading style sheet and their corresponding examples basically there are three types of cascading style sheets the first one is inline css second one is internal and third one is external now we are going to see what is inline css and how it's going to be applied to the html tag let's see Actually, this is a basic HTML format. You guys know already. There will be a HTML tag and HTML close tag, and head and close head inside the head. You will be having title tag. Here, what you are whatever you are typing, that will be visible in your browser. I mean, the tag tab inside the body. We have a paragraph tag. This is a paragraph. Is a paragraph that we have having now now we are going to apply the inline css to the paragraph tag let's see how it's going to be into the paragraph tag let's make a small space and after that type as style actually style is a keyword if you want to use a inline css you have to use that keyword and make a equal symbol and put two double quotes inside the double quotes the content whatever you are going to type here like uh, if you want to apply a red color for this paragraph tag I mean this is a paragraph is a content of a paragraph so this is a paragraph will be shown in color red let's try this just make a color and the color of the paragraph tag is going to be red and make a semicolon and save it as style.cshtml every document should be with the extension of html that's why only you can have this in your browser just save it and see this is a paragraph is our actual content this is actually showing in a color red and that's all about the inline css